In this video, we're going to show you how to use uh, breakout rooms on Chromebooks uh, while customizing the groups. Okay, on other devices, this is very easy to do. We could just have the group members select their own breakout, but on Chromebooks, we do not have that luxury. So this is what we're going to do. The teacher is going to first put the predetermined groups uh, on the blackboard or whiteboard or whatever uh, background slide that they want to use. Once you have the groups there, you're going to ask the students to go rename themselves. Most students know how to do this already, but you go to participants, you hover over uh, their name, and they will select rename. And what you want them to do is put the group number that they're in out in front of their name because what's going to happen is when we go to populate the groups, uh, it's going to be in numerical order. So let me get out of this real quick and go over to the breakout rooms. In the breakout rooms, um, we're going to hit recreate here. So we're going to assign manually. Remember that the let the participants choose will not work. Uh, unless they have a something other than a Chromebook, such as their phone or a laptop or what have you. So we're going to hit Recreate. It's going to bring up the three rooms. We're going to hit Assign. And when we do this, it's going to show up in numerical order. So if the first four students had a one in front, they would all be at the top, and you would simply just click all of them to be in the first room. All right. Then you go to the second room number, and you hit all the people that have the two out in front. You go to the third, you hit um, the same thing here. So now once we have all of the uh, members of the class in their groups, we would just hit open all rooms, and we will send them into their breakout rooms. So it's that simple. Just follow those simple steps, and that should do the trick. 